Well, it is everyone's favorite time of the week. It is time to find a forever home for a furry friend this morning. Rascal is a one-year-old pointer mix up for adoption at Palmetto Lifeline. Joining us now is Maria Wooten from Palmetto Lifeline, of course, with our favorite little rascal here. <laughs> Tell us a little bit more about him and what people should know if they would like to adopt him. Sure, so he is about a year old, so he's still very young. He was found as a stray by animal control. Um, he was microchipped, so okay. we were able to locate the owner, but um, unfortunately they did not want him back, which is you know very sad because yeah. he's a great dog. But basically, you know, there's a, a city and county ordinance that every dog that is found at large must be neutered. Yeah. And she did not want him back because he was going to be neutered because she used him for breeding. Yeah. So oh. she no longer saw any value in him, which is really sad because he really is terrible. like yeah. awesome dog, Come like on. perfect. So uh, anyways, he's here with us now. We're wanting to find him a forever home, but he's phenomenal. I mean, yes. he deserves a loving family that will never abandon him. I mean, he's incredibly sweet. I mean, just a great family dog, very mm -hmm. loyal, um, just wants to love and be loved. He is looking Tony right in the eye right yeah, now. Like, like, take me home, take me home. He is take such me a home. lover boy. <laughs> he really has the prettiest <laughs> eyes, too. <laughs> I tell you, he's on that emotional I level. know. Yeah, he and he so came handsome. in just being so friendly. He's so never playful, met a stranger ever. You know, so he's just an all around <laughs> good guy. Loves to give kisses and, yeah. and get the belly rubs. Just a sweet, you know, when he gets super excited, he wags his whole body. <laughs> it's the cutest thing ever. So, just a wonderful dog, you know. <laughs> Very deserving of a loving forever yeah, I was going to say, deserves a lot better than yeah. what happened to him with that story. Yeah. That's, yeah, that, that hurts for sure. Any health concerns that you all have been uh, noticing? Or? Um, I believe he has some kind of like a UTI right now, okay. but that's something we're working on clearing up. And then, you know, he's he's perfectly healthy. Otherwise, he's heartworm negative. You know, he's been neutered, vaccinated, ready to go home with you forever. Oh, his yeah. coat is so beautiful. Yeah. You want to show him your pretty so suit? Oh, and I know he's only he's oh, only a one-year-old cool. boy, so he definitely has yeah. a lot of energy. Lot of How energy. does he do uh, with other animals or with kids? Oh, my gosh. He, like, literally loves everyone. He is great <laughs> with dogs. He's even great with cats. He's great with kids. He's great with everyone. Mm. I mean, he's he is... People come in wanting to adopt the perfect dog sometimes. I mean, mm -hmm. here he is. He's wow. as close to perfect as you can get. He's <laughs> such a sweet boy. That's what I mean. He's, I mean, sometimes it takes a little bit more training. You know, he's obviously still reserved as well. I mean, mm -hmm. he's not crazily jumping around. He's just connecting with all of us, mm -hmm. and he's just obviously very happy to be here this morning. Absolutely. He he's can a make sweet you happy boy. as well at home. <laughs> That's right. So, so yeah. if you'd like to adopt <laughs> Rascal or... Great segue, by the way. Oh, or any other pet <laughs> at Palmetto Lifeline. Adoptions are open from noon until 6 p.m. Tuesdays through Friday and 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. on Saturdays. And, of course, for a much smoother experience, you can complete an adoption application online before your visit. And, Tony, you got some exciting news about Palmetto Lifeline. Yeah, that's right. We're continuing to uh, help them go on forward into this holiday season. You know, just talking with everyone at the shelter. I know this time of the year is a little bit more pressing, just needing dry pet food donations for cats and dogs. It's their pet soup program. It's a great program. It helps a lot of families in the area in need that just really require that pet food assistance. So, you know, if you could donate, you know, you really want to help out this holiday season, you know, as simple as bringing any dry cat and dog food to their location. That's 1275 Bower Parkway. 1275 Bower Parkway. Again, Columbia address, but it's over there in Irmo. You know, stop by the shelter. I'm sure they'd love to see you. And I'm sure Rascal would love a walk outside right now. It's a little cold, but you know. Rascal's sure going to need a jacket. A, a jacket, yeah. right? <laughs> At least he's got the fur. Yeah. 